Liz DIY Christmas gift. I killed everybody and welcome to another Ms. Leah's Christmas DIY gifts and it's a new segment, well actually it's an old segment that we've been doing for a few years now but this year we decided to film some of the stuff that we're going to be doing today. So I have a special guest today, I have a kitty who is from our classic show and um, She's going to help me today. We're hopefully going to get all the announcers on, but today she's going to help me create this little gift. So anyway, Kitty, today we are making um, a very easy bath salt recipe. Have you ever used bath salts before? Uh, I have. Yeah? Um, yeah, they're good for exercise, you know, when you're just wanting to relax. And, yeah. Yeah, no, they're yeah. good. And they can be quite expensive. So yes. this is... An affordable option, so yes. that's always good, come yes. Christmas time. For sure. Save some food here. Exactly. So anyway, um, I'll just go through the stuff that we need. So you will need some Epsom salt, and these are pretty inexpensive, yeah. and you can get these from um, your hygiene aisle at your local supermarket. So yep, that's what I've got here. Um, we've also got some rock salt. And yeah, that can be quite inexpensive as well, and you can get it in bulk as well, which is really good. And then in front, I've got some food colouring. I've just got, you know, your classic green and red, um, just to spruce it up a bit and give it a little bit of um, a beautiful smell. I've got some um, lavender oil right here. You want to make sure you get the 100% stuff because it, you know, it lasts a lot longer. I understand if you don't want to get Lurev because that's a bit costly, but there is other brands out there that are a little bit cheaper. Uh, and then also we've got a little jar to pop the salts in and some measuring jugs just to do half and half, you'll see very soon. And just a few other things that we're going to decorate our, um, our little jar with. So we might as well just get into it. So first of all, Kenny, I just want you to measure the, that whole lot of salt into there, actually. And half of the eggs and Yep, the whole lot. Yep, the whole lot. And then, three quarters of a cup that is. Yep, and then you want to do exactly the same with the eggs and salt. So that will take us up to about one and a half cups. Yep. Cool. And then just mix it around and get that all mixed in together. So what do you love about Christmas, Kitty? Oh, just having a holiday. Yeah. <laughs> having, having a break, holiday. spending time with Sano. Yeah. Um, barbecue, swimming, yeah. sunshine, I know. laughter, the community. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, I love the food. I love Christmas. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so now we're just going to yeah. add a few drops of our essential oil. And I've gone for lavender. I love lavender. Nice. So calming. So we're just going to add a few drops. Oh. Oh, yeah. Few few drops. Few drops. <laughs> smells good, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it smells already. It's really nice. Do you take baths often, Kitty? Not particularly. Yeah. Not as often as I'd like to. Yeah, I know. Um, it's just that time, you know, if I'm going to have a bath, I like to sort of sit in there for at least so, half an hour. Yeah, know, so I can exactly. It. But of course, in the summertime, nice you want to conserve that water. Yeah, that's I don't know true. about Taranaki, sometimes, it, sometimes we have rain, sometimes we don't. Oh, we just mm, that smells beautiful. So the reason why I've got the second cup is we're going to half mm. both of these. So Kitty, okay. if you would like to half these. So do you have a favourite Christmas carol? Oh, that's a good question. Um, yeah. Jingle Bell Rock. <laughs> yeah. I know, it's good as that. And Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Oh yeah. yeah. Gotta go for the Just classics, so, eh? Yeah, some classic the ones, classics. The right. classics. Alright, this is the part right. where you really want to be careful how much drops you do. So I'll give you the green one, Kitty. Are you spare me? And I'll grab, grab you want some festive colours. Yes. Red festive, and green. red and green. So just a couple of drops, is it? Just, yeah, just a couple of drops. Very little. Just very little. 
Oh, oh, there, yep, yep, there we go. Okay, so I'll go with this fork. And you just want to mix that all up into there until you get a really nice oh. red colour. I don't know if you'll need to add any more, but if you do, you know, you can do that. And the cool thing is it actually turns your bar like a really nice colour. Well, actually, I hope it's not red because that would look a little bit scary, wouldn't it? Red and green, what does yeah. that usually make? Red and green, what a big purple. purple. That's what I was thinking. Back to, back to primary school, just remembering the colours. Yeah, the colour yeah. yeah. wheel. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, orange. Yeah, mine's just a little bit orange, so I might have to add a little bit more in, won't I? And that's okay, you can do that. So, Epsom salts makes your skin feel really beautiful, really soft. Nice! Awesome kitty. Do you think that's green enough? I so, um, I've got some really cute tags here, and I'm going to decorate mine first, and Kitty's going to go for it on her one. And I think I might use a little bit of this red twine. Oh, cool! Okay. It looks cool. Look at that. You can already see the little effect. So, I'm going to write Merry Christmas on this. I think I might give it to my nan. So these gifts are really good for your nan, or your auntie, or your sister, or your best friend. And the other thing about this is you can actually do this very last minute. That's how um, easy this is. So where did you pick the jars up from? Are they pretty accessible? Or? Yes, I've actually still got the oh, yes. stuff on it. <laughs> this was only $1.99. Awesome. So, and you can reuse it afterwards if you wanted to. I quite like the look of that red ribbon over there. Yeah, sure. That. And you can pick up so many cute little things. If you've got your own card at home that you want to you want to do, like you want to use, then, then that's totally fine. I picked up these cute little cowbells and they remind me of Christmas. I love the Polar Express. Yes. I know that it's an animated film, but I love it. What's your favourite film? Oh, Christmas film. Oh, wow. It's been a while. Oh, really? Cartoons or the Christmas movies, only probably oh, the first year. I um, love Home Alone. Anything, any of the Disney movies. Yeah. Disney's movies are so good. Um, and if you if you watch out at Christmas time, they bring out all yeah, the Christmas yeah, it movies. Is. It's awesome. Like over Christmas into the New Year, eh? They'll have yeah. Them. It just smells so beautiful in here right now, Anna. And if you wanted to make a bigger one, if you think, oh, that's that's a little bit little yeah. for my auntie. I know she loves having baths. You can purchase big jar, little jar, oval jar, square jar. You can do whatever you like. Obviously, you'll need more stuff for it, like more Epsom salt, more rock salt. Exactly. Hey, thank you so much, Kitty, for joining me. Awesome. We possibly might get you in for another one. We'll see how these pan out. But anyway, thank you so much for joining us. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We're hopefully bringing some more Christmas cheer to the channel. But also some more videos of various kopapa and stuff like that will be coming to the channel. But thank you very much, Kitty, for joining awesome. me. Thanks, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, family.